Hey, I'm Justin. I'm Linnea. We're the two travelers. And today we're at Guazu, Seven Waterfalls. Hello there. Today we're at uh, Guazu Nanadaru, which is uh, Guazu Seven Waterfalls. Um, we, we have first heard about this from our favorite vloggers, Katie and Eric. And it wasn't originally something we were planning on this trip, but our first video we saw of them was at this place, mm -hmm. and so we thought we should come and check it out. Yeah, it looks really pretty, and it's really pretty in real life too. Yeah, I didn't know it, it was going to be like this. This is only the first waterfall so far. And it's, oh, but instead of going um, up the mountain, we are going down. Yeah, we took a bus up to the top of the mountain, which took kind of a long time, yeah. just because we had to take a bus from our Airbnb to a train station. Then a train. And then a bus to uh, the top of the mountain here. So it took a while. I think it'll be worth it. Oh, definitely, because we're going to walk down the mountain and then take a bus back to that train station. But uh, it's pretty nice here. And I'm looking forward to the rest. It's not busy at all, either. Oh, yeah, so. there's nobody here. Yeah. We're literally the only ones here right now. So. Lucky for us. So something we didn't talk about today was uh, breakfast. breakfast. It, we were really rushed on time because we were trying to, you know, figure out how to do the kayaking tomorrow and like, getting to the train station that we went to McDonald's. <laughs> We've been planning on going to McDonald's at some point during the trip. I didn't expect it to be during this one. Just no. Because it's like a beach coastal. Yeah, we're in a beach town. area and it's foresty and it's nice. And it's as far away as from those big buildings as we can get. Yeah. And so that's what we had though. We had McDonald's. My bur I just got a cheeseburger and it tasted exactly the same as in the US. And I got um, some American burger. It was yep. American Smoke smoky burger. smoky American, American burger. burger. What was in there? I didn't even some ask sort you. of barbecue or something. I didn't really recognize the flavor that much. But it was McDonald's. It wasn't anything special. But you said it was better than that most burger place. I felt like it was better than most burger. Um, I didn't just because it was a little bit bigger and had a little bit more going on in it, but I still don't really like either of them. Yeah. Oh, the ketchup was really strange. It well, was. it wasn't strange, it was just different. It was different ketchup. It wasn't normal ketchup. It was, uh, is it more like, uh, marinara, marinara to me? But, yeah, wasn't anything special. But now we're at Summer Awesome, so, yeah. When I think of hiking, Usually I think of like dirt paths and trails, something along those lines. When I think of hiking, I think of me being at home not hiking. <laughs> but um, there's a lot of stairs, like actual wooden stairs everywhere. Um, I don't mind it. It's like nice it. looking. Yeah, I like <laughs> it. It just wasn't what I was expecting. It's nice though. I don't know how well you can hear me, but... We're at a waterfall! Yeah, I don't think that other one we're at was one of the waterfalls. I hope it was because if they keep getting bigger, that'd be awesome. This is a waterfall. It's super misty. I like this one a lot more. Me too. I wish I could go swimming in it. One thing we brought to Japan was this water-resistant notepad. And it was more so to make notes that we didn't want to forget about the trip. But it turned into something entirely different. It's a stamp book. So, pretty much everywhere we've gone has had stamps. Train stations, the aquarium, sites. temples. So we've been trying to collect as many as we can uh, as we go along. But this is the last place I thought we would find one. It's actually a little box right of here. Of course, it's crazy. But we have it with us, so we're prepared. So uh, at this Seven Waterfalls, they have uh, the Wishing Rock out there, and the Wishing Rock. If you pay 100 yen, which is no one out here to actually collect the payment, but uh, it's kind of like an honor system, you put the 100 yen in there. You can throw three rocks, and if one of your rocks makes it into the basket, your wish comes true. And if your wish comes true, you have to come and visit here again. So, I'm gonna try.
So we finished our day over at uh, the Seven Waterfalls. Kawazu. And well, it was really nice and I really enjoyed it. I wouldn't go out of my way to come here. Yeah, I was like, man, I kind of feel like we wasted a day. Since we're I don't only know here, though. But not wasted, yeah. but we could have done something a little better. Yeah, I was kind of thinking we probably should have spent time at one of the beaches. Um, but I, I, I mean, the area was, it was really nice. I, I feel like we got our feel of that kind of scene from Hushimi and Ari yeah. walking through a forest. And you couldn't really get up to the water too often. Uh, and when we did get to the water, it was really cold. Cool. Oh, I, I liked it, but um, yeah, I wouldn't go out of my way to come here. But now we're back um, in Shimoda. And Something um, I pointed out to Justin was I was like, why do they have all these pallets at all the stations? And I was like, duh. Um, Shimoda is, um, the city is the inspiration for Pallet Town in Pokemon. In Pokemon. So I was like, duh, oh my gosh. Yeah, so this pallets. right here. Pallets over there, pallets over there, Pallet Town. This is a tricking bridge. How's it a tricking bridge? It has stairs. Oh, it does have stairs. <laughs> might be known for wasabi. I'm not sure, but all around here it says like Kawazu wasabi. And I saw that they had wasabi ice cream. I've never had wasabi ice cream. I never even thought that wasabi would be an ice cream. <laughs> but I guess it sounds good. It's like, like wasabi? Um, it has like the after um, tingling of wasabi, but it doesn't really taste like wasabi. It tastes good though. Wanna try it? Yeah. That, that train is like leaking pee or something. It's yellow. Sorry. I don't know what wasabi tastes like, by the way. It's like caramel. Oh! Like spicy. At the end, yeah, it's spicy at the end. What the heck? Ice cream's not supposed to be spicy. That's weird. I don't, I don't taste anything, any flavor, like just cream. And then it starts burning my tongue. That's weird. I got this really weird candy, and I'm super afraid to try it. But the box looks really good. Just kidding. <laughs> Hi, if you liked our video, give us a thumbs up. Or if you'd like to see more of our videos, you can click here to see our last video. And if you want to keep updated with future videos, subscribe below.